Hi, I'm Nick with Shop Class 101, and today we're going to teach you how to test an automotive relay. Testing relays is very simple, especially once you understand how they work. A relay is simply a switch that controls high current with low current. And this four pin relay uses these two connectors here to connect to a low current way that you would switch it. Think like your headlight switch. And then it has an in and an out for the high current load, like your headlights. And you can use a low current switch to activate this coil, which creates an electromagnet and pulls this switch closed, connecting these two pins right here. Here's a close-up of that relay. You can see the copper windings on the electromagnet and off on the right you can see the brass tab. Those are the contacts that the relay pulls closed when it's energized. Here you'll see I've got the same relay with the cover on attached on one side of the coil to the negative battery charger lead and the other side of the coil ready to go to get attached to the positive side of the battery charger lead. We'll turn on a battery charger on low amp setting and then we're going to take the positive lead and touch it to the battery charger lead and we should hear that relay click. That's the first indicator that our relay is working. So now we're going to test that our relay is working electrically. We're going to take our DVOM, digital volt ohmmeter, and we're going to set it up for resistance tests. First we'll take the ground lead and put it in the black common port. Then we'll take the power lead and put it in volts, ohms, hertz. Next we'll turn our meter to test resistance. Or possibly if we're not near where we can see it, we can set it up to test for continuity. On a continuity test, anytime red and black are touching, it'll give us an audible warning note. Next, we're going to energize the relay, and then we're going to touch the black test lead to the other terminal on the relay and see if we get power across the relay. So we'll energize the relay. We heard it click when I turned it on. And you can probably hear that audible tone and the resistance going through the relay is on the screen. That proves to us that our relay is working. I certainly hope that you enjoyed our relay testing today. If you have any questions, drop them below in the comments section. If there's any other tests you'd like us to perform, please let us know. And as always, if you like the content here, please subscribe. Thanks folks, we'll see you again.